Hey guys, how you doing? And welcome back to the channel. Today we have another DHgate um, football shirt. Obviously fake, but to pay the prices you have to these days to get the legit ones, it's ridiculous. The prices are through the roof. So I don't mind. This is for my own personal wearing, you know, and stuff like that. And if it rips or anything, it's quite cheap to go and get another one. It's about it can get range from anything from like eight pounds up to 15, 20 pounds, depends. Uh, this one cost me, I think it was 15 pounds. I took, it took ages. I ordered this before the Women's World Cup, not to wear, to go and watch a Women's World Cup or anything like that. But I just know the time that I ordered it. It was just before the World Cup. It was about two, two and a half months, this one. So I don't know if I'll buy from this seller again, even though the shirt is in really nice condition of what I've seen so far. Um, I unwrapped it because I completely forgot about it. Um, so, uh, it's in the bag. I obviously took the packaging off the thing and I was like, ah, that's the, uh, shirt I ordered. So let's get straight into it. As you'll see from the thumbnail, it is the England Euro 96 shirt with number eight. We all know who that is. Absolute legend. Um, we've got fair play, uh, badge on it. And we also have the Euro 96 badge on it really nice material really nice shirt i haven't seen any issues there's a little maybe loose thread just there obviously in the comments guys if you know anything that doesn't look right with this shirt let me know um ask me any questions you'd like to ask me i don't mind i'll answer uh, the best of my knowledge uh, and on the back obviously we'll flip it over we have the legend himself gascoigne number eight euro 96 um the number is on there perfectly. Really nice um, shirt. Material is quite nice. It's quite lightweight. Uh, I never owned this shirt uh, in in '96 or any other time. I've never owned this shirt, so I do, can't. I don't know what the material was like. It is quite a fine material, um, so I'm not too sure. But I know that the remake of this came out obviously with just the england badge and there was no umbro so it wouldn't surprise me if they got hold of that embroidered the umbro and then put obviously i asked for a gascoigne eight on it so it wouldn't surprise me if that's what they've done they've kind of got a bunch of the replica england shirts and then they've embroidered the umbro on and then obviously they've got the patches and stuck them on really nice patches are on really really well obviously they're heat pressed um, but they are they are stuck on there. They're not coming off anytime soon. Uh, like I say, there is a little bit of a loose thread just there, but that would be easy just to cut off. Obviously, the number on the back, absolutely perfect. No, it, it's not. It's just crinkled the way it's been folded. It isn't loose. There's no peeling or anything like that. It is properly heat pressed on. It just needs hanging up and flattening out. Um, we'll have a quick look on the inside. Obviously, you do get, remember, always order a size up. I'm a large, so I ordered extra large. And on the inside, the inside looks absolutely fine. Um, obviously, you've got the labels up here, which mean nothing. But it wouldn't surprise me, like I said, if this is the replica without the umbra and they've just added everything onto it, which I absolutely do not mind. The badge and the umbra on the back, well sewed in. Um, I think that is, yeah, is that sewed in? Yeah, sewed in, not heat pressed. Looks absolutely beautiful beautiful shirt i love this shirt i want to get the gray one as well like i said make sure you subscribe i will be getting loads of shirts from dh gate it's just obviously they some of them take time to get here to get the videos recorded for you guys to have a look at but like i said this is a nice shirt took a bit longer than i was hoping for it to arrive you know like a couple of months but it's really nice hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did make sure you like the video make sure you leave a comment or anything you want to know anything you'd like to ask um Make sure you hit subscribe. Let's try and hit 4,000 by the end of the year. And like I said, plenty more DHK shirts coming. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.